Who's ready for this shit? So I tried to play through the other the other thing that I was just in, the PDR or whatever it was called, and that was shit, but I've, I've improved some things for this video because the other one had a boost on, which is why you could hear every single sound my mouth made. And uh, playing that other tank was actually really annoying because I kept getting one thing, like one map, and it was not a good map for me, and so I kept getting blowed up. This thing, though, this thing, we've moved on to the Valentine AT. I recorded some, but I reached, like, the limit. So we're going to go through a quick, a quick walkthrough with this tank, show you how it looks and uh, what it's got inside of it. So it's 60 all the way around for hull armor, so it's actually quite, it's quite defensible from the front. Um, it's best gun. Well, it has two best guns, but here's a tier 5. It does that which is the, that derp cannon, just a cannon, which is mostly made for other uh, tank destroyers and other good shit like that, and I don't want to do that. I like those. Those are good. 110 armor piercing. That's, I think, an extra 50 from what we had with the other tank. You know, I kept bouncing shots, and that was annoying, but now we should be fine. It also goes faster. Same damage, though, so that's kind of sad. See, <sighs> see, I, I, mm. The other tanks of this tier have pretty good stuff too, I guess. Uh, I got one battle with it, so I have 303 experience. And I want to get this, because I have less chance of being set aflame. Um, this thing already has terrible maneuverability, so this isn't going to change it too much. So we're just going to go ahead and stick another engine in it. Bam. Uh, and then as soon as possible, we're going to get this. Because it just has better everything. I'm already glad that it can get through must armor, though. Uh, it's good for bouncing shots. I actually bounced a few shots. We still lost because there was two of them and I was the last one left. And they can get around you pretty easy because this thing is slow as tits. Uh, from what you can see, the front is very slightly sloped. Uh, it's got some weakness here, like right in the here. Right there and right there. Uh, and the sides are straight flat. And as you can tell, that's where the ammo goes. So if they can pin your sides, they can probably explode you instantaneously. Uh, from the back, it has the same armor as it has on the front, but there's another flat piece right there. It'll probably bounce off that part, and this part, and those parts, and maybe even this thing. Um, and from here, uh, if you can angle it like that, this and this will give you the same armor values, but this is more sloped on a different axis as well as all this. So try it more like that, more like uh, sloping it like that at them, and they're going to have a terrible time. But you can't really get your gun in that direction, so maybe a little more like that. And you might have the best results. I can't, I don't know how far to that side it goes. But that's what we're going to find out today, by going into a battle. <laughs> Let's hope that the things that I'm doing isn't complete shit. <laughs> oh good, a tier 3 battle. So hopefully we won't die immediately. And we're in the map mines. For some reason, it's decided to got, stop giving me copper fields, so that is, that is fantastic. So for this one, you know, I've never gotten the other side of this map, on this game at least. The one on the computer I do, but this one just no. I always get this side, going up this hill. Never been over on the other side before. I know what it looks like. And the tactics are a little bit more difficult. Um, for this, since I'm a sniper stank, I'm gonna get right up here. And so is the medium, apparently. Despite the fact that, you know, it's not really made for this. Oh, ball sack. Okay, so, with them all right there, I'm going to go ahead and hop into this bush. Hop into this bush. And I'm going to do a turning. I don't have to get forward a little bit, because I can't see for balls. And... Nothing's really popping out for me. I'm waiting for this M2 medium, but... I don't want to go up there, because I really just can't. Uh, no, medium, you're gonna get fucking cu Oh, wait, there he is. Hello, medium. Are you ready to get popped like a fucking zit? Oh, never mind, somebody else did it for me. And then there's another guy coming up that way. Maybe he'll just crest over the... <coughs> crest over the hill like a dummins. But apparently not. Okay, so we know that there's like three of them over there. So we might... Oh. <laughs> oh, they're just getting wrecked. We're gonna go ahead and leave this spot. Because we're not getting anything done. They might be coming from this direction. Oh, no, they're all clustered over there. And I am slow as shit. 
So that looks like it's going to be our first victory in this thing. Um, and we didn't do shit. So that's cool. Maybe I'll... Nope, there, there's three of them over there. If anything, we're going to run into another... Uh, fucking... What'd you call it? Another tank destroyer going this way. Nope, they're all down there. So the route that I'm taking is circuitous and slow... And I'm probably not actually going to see any action. I'm surprised this thing has 102 rounds, seeing as how it doesn't really maneuver very well. Maybe I should just go for the big spam cannon. I have no idea. No, it's really only if I find really not very heavily armored tanks. And there are some of this tier that have enough damage, or have enough um, all-around... Whatchamacallit, to, to stop this thing from doing any damage entirely. It looks like we might be able to get some shots on this Cruiser 4. Oh, wow. We actually lost some dudes. How are we sucking? Don't suck. Come on, where's that Cruiser 2? Hello? Cruiser 2? Wow, we are getting fucked now, for some reason. There's... Sorry, the Cruiser 4. Come on, come on! Trying to come up from behind? It's not working. It's not working. Oh, shit. There's a Sue. Hello. Ah, fuck me. Hello, pretty baby. I'm gonna win. You used your thing. Now you're fucked. I'm looking at you now, Cruiser 2. I can get right through that armor. Didn't you believe me? All right, and my other dude is just fucking around. So if I actually get cornered, I'm fucking dead. There's another Cruiser 4. I see you, Cruiser 4. Gotcha! Little tag on the bottom. Making sure he can't cap. I don't want to go too far up this way, because then the other guy will see me. And that is garbage. Sorry. No such luck. Ah, fuck. Might not work. This might not work out so well for me. Don't reload, don't reload, don't reload. Gotcha, you fucking bitch. Yay, we won. That was terrifying. <laughs> now, I'm scared that this is going to go over, like, the certain memory limit that this app has. So, I'm going to keep it there. But, you see how this tank goes. How much did we get? 1,000 experience, which is pretty nice. I don't think we can buy anything with that. Oh, we can buy another engine, which gives it its one maneuverability back. Because it has slightly more engine power than, uh, than I think this. Yeah, slightly more. I don't know what the point is, actually. It probably goes into a different, like, the Electo or something. Because after this comes that, which has an extra 34. Ooh. Um, but I think what we want to go for next is probably that. Probably for the rate of fire. Because I don't... Because those uh, Cruiser 4s, if it was less, I, I wouldn't have been able to get through their turrets. Which, uh, which is the source of their power. Um, so yeah, that was the Valentine AT for now. Whenever I come back, I'll probably have either the next gun or enough experience to buy the Electo. So thank you all very much for watching this episode. I know it was really short, but I don't want to, I don't want to go over the amount of, um, memory this app has and fuck up. Because, uh, if it just cuts out and it's all a weird, awkward ending, I can't really post it. So, so that's what I'm doing. I, I hope you all enjoyed. That was a pretty good round for me as well, I noticed. Blech. So, you have a fantastic day. I love you very much, and I will see you next time. Good night.